Hey guys, Lapcraft here, and today I have made a vertical six piston extender with redstone, and I'm going to make a tutorial on it. So, um, first of all, you have to make the mechanism of the thing. So, you place six observers one block away from each other. Three, four, five, six. Then, what you do is you place repeaters in front of them, set to four ticks, um, all going in the same direction. Um, then what you do is you place uh, pistons right there but with um, a little bit of like a block of space between that and you just do that all the way across here and also one right there then you place blocks in front of these pistons like this then um, then what you do is you have you have to make this um, this th this right here. Uh, wait. Oh, okay. So you also have to make this powered right here. So now what you do is you go one, two, three up. Then you go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and you go one down. Then then what you do is you place a block here up on top of the pistons and between them and you just place repeaters in between them all set to four ticks and then so what this will do is it will change the way like the order in which the, it will um, like open or go up and go down so I, I'll show you an example of how it works right now so this thing it it goes um, up like an elevator, so it's basically an extender or an elevator. I like to use it uh, as an elevator because it's especially cool. See, like, just want to go down. So, um, next, next up, what you have to do is well, you can place blocks in front of these. Um, so we can test this right, right now. So. So what we do, well, when you um, first build it, this has to be powered. So you one, two, three, four, five, six, right in that order. Then when it goes back, uh, lag, four, five, six. Okay, good. That's how it's supposed to work. All right, next, what you do is basically, oh, wait. All right, so when, when you build it, this has to be on. Otherwise, it, you'll have problems with it. It's just not very fun. Um, so you build this kind of pattern, like three and three. It has to be kind of far away from this, otherwise it, it'll just get really crowded and basically impossible to do. And what you do is you put slime blocks on top of this, and this. Then what? These have to be in order. So this one goes to this piston. The second one goes to this piston. The third one goes to that piston, and then. Fourth, fifth, sixth go up like this. So um, to wire it, what we do is oh, that was a crazy lag there. So um, so just place a redstone line going across here. I kind of uh, it's better if you use some ticks in between those because uh, it'll, otherwise it'll just be like weird. So right there, there's one. So that will power the first piston. Um, I'm just using a normal block right now, but later you'll have to use terracotta right here or any other movable things that you can put. Um, you can put like that. It won't it won't be moved by slime blocks, but you can still put redstone on and stuff, and it can be powered. So that's the first piston. Next, you do this piston right here. All right. So this has to just power this it doesn't have to power like anything else but just this one so this this will go up so you're going to need a repeater or rest of dust doesn't really matter and you just put that right there and these because this is kind of crowded so you're going to need to do something like this you don't have to follow this exact pattern but you just have to wire them up without them interfering. So right there, you have to block that one off so that it won't interfere with that one. 
So now you just you can place them. Okay, so this is a slime block. So you have to place an immovable object right there. Then, um, all right, this is getting in the way, so you have to block that off. Okay, now this this one has to go like this, and make sure it's not interfering with the other blocks. Just make sure it's not being powered by something else. Then, basically, just continue this pattern with all of the other um, all like all the other redstone lines for all the other pistons. So this one will be going into this piston right here. And this has to be terracotta or any other removable object otherwise it won't work. Also these things, once you get up here, if, if you want it to look better, you're going to have to like drop it down one and power this. So so you basically just do this and it will it will work. Um, because then it will still power this and it will look better once you get up, up there. So, now this one, right here, this redstone line, is the fourth one. So, yeah, you just basically just put it, alright. Oh, oh, but this one, uh, yeah, so this block is right here, so... You're gonna need to have it go around like this to make it look good, but yeah. Um, make sure none of these repeaters are set to two ticks, otherwise the one tick pulse will become a two tick pulse and it will just ruin the whole thing. So you're going to need to um, make sure that none of them are at two ticks. They all have to be at one tick except for these ones which all have to be at four ticks. Um, but Mostly that's all you really need to know for building this. So, this is just the fifth redstone line. And if you have any problems, then you'll have to troubleshoot it, which is kind of difficult because the, these always just mess everything up and it's, it's really frustrating. But um, Also, if you get over 15 blocks of redstone, so one, two, three, four, block that one off. Okay. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So that's just 14, so it's fine. But if you get over 15, you can just place another repeater. It won't do much unless you place like a ton of repeaters. Try not to do that. That will just not end very well for you. Alright, next is the 6th redstone line. Now this is the last one. So hopefully I haven't done anything wrong. <laughs> that would stink. Let's see. Um... So this this redstone line is only one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Yeah, so it's over fifteen, so that means you'll have to have another repeater in there. That's just somewhere. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, let's just put a repeater right here. Alright, then redstone dust all along there. So, um, make sure none of this redstone is connected, because that will just, it will ruin the whole thing. Alright, but this right here, this isn't good, so what, if this happens, you'll just have to, like, just block this off and do just like this. So, this is all blocked off. Alright. That's good. Alright, make sure this is powered because otherwise it's just not going to work at all. Alright, let's just test it. Alright. So. Uh oh. Oh. I see what we did here. So. All right, we're gonna have to move everything up a block. So, what this did? Oh, wait a second. Yeah, we're gonna need to move everything up a block. So, um, 
So the, it just basically just skipped this one, so it didn't even power it. So, yeah. So it's not even that hard to move everything up a block. All you have to do is just like this, this. All right. Oh, okay, so that's moved up one, that's moved up, that's moved up. So make sure it's correct as to line though. So, so this one goes right here. So, all right, this one goes to that. This one, this one goes to this one. So, I'll just move this up one. And this one will be free to go to this one. And block this off. All right. Oh, wait. All right, so. All right, now that this is basically fixed, we have to change the order of this thing right here. So, um, so this is off, so this needs to be in full extended position. This usually doesn't happen, but. All right, so this will go like this. Up one. Up one, up one. And then the slime block will be one block away from this. Alright, there. So now when you turn it on, alright, great, this one has been blocked off by something, oh, it must have gone over 15. Hold on a second. So, yeah, you just have to do this. Alright. Now to try that again. Um, so I'm just going to break all these slime blocks, turn it off, and then it will all turn. And we can do this again. One away from this. Alright, now if you turn it on, four, five, six, turn it off. One, two, three, four, five, six. There. And that's all you really need to know. What what you can do is just put some immovable blocks on the along the sides and on the back. And maybe some T flip flops on on the like for the buttons on the sides, which I've done on the first one I built. Uh oh. Don't do that. So now that's fully working. Now this one I also built earlier. And this is the first one I built that surprised me that it worked because like it was amazing. So I just put a button right here. So it's a T flip flop right here. And it just runs redstone around that. This one is a lot cleaner. Should have just done this exactly how I did it over there. And it's pretty fast too. Not really, but it's pretty safe though. And it's kind of simple, but you can go wrong with it. It's just, yeah, that's all you really need to know. And make sure this is always being powered, otherwise it's not going to work. And, uh, yeah, that's about all the time I have for today. Um, see you next time.